Quick little video for you. I don't think a lot of the big 3D print YouTubers out there with their 500,000, 8 million freaking subscribers like really show this nitty gritty kind of stuff. Like, look, like, look at all this stuff. Like, look, there's a dead moth in there, okay? There's a live one somewhere back there behind the dehumidifier, but we're not going to talk about them. What we're going to talk about is, first of all, you see inside there? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you can see that all the way down through. Isn't that isn't that amazing? Yeah. Hi. So you have this wonderful little boat tube. Don't worry, the power the power is uh, turned off and everything. So, but look, ready? We all the way through. Okay, that is the difference between a regular crappy stock kind of. Uh, hot end and what a all metal hot end ready i'm going to take off this little coupling here at the end it's just the regular push block coupling just like you've seen before on different things here and there for bowden tubes this is a capricorn bowden tube uh you know i just snipped off a little piece and as i showed you know just because it was the same as the old piece that's what blew up I'm going to start off with a picture. That's what blew up my nozzle, that, that block right there. But as you can see, I can't, I can't get it in there. That's because of, where's the camera? Ooh, do you see that? Well, look, you can actually see the light through there, okay? That 1.7 millimeter filament is going to stop. What is that? Let's see. This far, that far, those threads. I'm looking over there. There's the camera. <laughs> I'm really pissed off. I had a 20 hour print going and everything seemed all right. And then I came home and um, I went fishing for like five minutes and uh, I actually got a fish. And I was like so happy because I never catch fish because I don't, I don't know how to fish. I'm, I'm really bad at that. So anyways, this is what an all metal hot end is. It looks I didn't put that in my mouth. It looks exactly like this. Different color, of course. Okay. Same sizes and everything like that. The heat sink's a little bit different. The block is not, you know, this one's brass. This one's, I don't know, some kind of an alloy probably. Uh, it's a lot heavier than this old piece that I keep on dropping everywhere. This is probably going to be the funniest, stupidest video I'm ever going to do, but I needed to show you guys. Where's the camera again? I needed to show you exactly what this looks like. So, um, as I said, I got this. This was this was the one I ordered off of AliExpress when the last block blew up. I needed an all metal hot end because I wanted one, and because um, I had one before. But um, we're not going to talk about what I did to that. So. Don't do drugs, kids. Just don't do them. I bought this from AliExpress. The first one got lost. The second one got lost. And then the third one finally arrived here. This has been in my possession for, I want to say, like three weeks. AliExpress is still sending me things right now that say, hey, it's on its way. So hopefully they'll send me more. But... I'm going to replace that. I'm going to try to finish the stupid thing. But that was from Creality. That was from the, the, what do you call it? The uh, direct drive that I bought from them. Um, crap. Just crap. Crap like my hair. Look at my hair. Oh, frig, is this thing even on?